Hi, uh, today I want to uh, solve this problem, show you how to use your financial calculator to adjust the uh, when you are compounding at annually, uh, semi-annually, quarterly, monthly, and daily. So uh, let's uh, see the problem. Maggie wants to purchase a house in five years, so this is your aim. She wants to invest uh, $87 in an investment today, which is your present value. And this investment will give her a 6% annual return. So this is your return. So how much will she have at the 5 year? You want to find the future value. So if this is compound at annually, uh, semi-annually, quarterly, monthly, and daily. So I already give you the answer here. Uh, if you compound, if you compound at annually, you will get this much. Semi annually, this is this much. So you should know the the more you frequently, uh, the frequency of the compounding, the number is increase. So you should when you invest in. Put money in your bank or you buy some investment you always prefer the high frequency of the compounding if they can compound at a daily even better i mean most of the time they are compound at a monthly so anyway so let's just show you how this being done in the your financial calculator how to find all those numbers so first one is annually so we want to know uh, always the PYCY is your uh, calculator. So PY annually is uh, CY is compounding uh, should be one enter PY equal to one CY equal to one. So once you done that, uh, we can input the number is 87. Negative present and six percent interest rate five is the year zero is the PMT. Then we compound the that give you one zero seven zero five eight. So this is exactly at this number. So this is annually. So uh when you send me annually, you make sure you all uh you all. PY at 1, CY at 2, CY is 2. Now, is CY is 2, we can do this 87 is your present value, 6% is your interest rate, 5 is and 0 is a uh, compute. It's 107513, this is exactly the same. Um, so now we want to do the quarterly. Quarterly is make sure your PY at 1, CY at 4, enter. So once you done that, then you do 87 is the present value. 6 is your interest rate. 5 is your year. 0 is your... Then you compute your future value. It's 107748 exactly is your quarterly. So let's do the monthly. Monthly, you have to make sure your PY at 1, CY is at 12, enter. So once you've done that, we do 87 is your present value, 6% is your interest rate, 5 is your annual zero is the PMT compute is 107908 so you can find it is exactly the same let's do the uh, daily is make sure your calculator is PY at 1 CY at 365 enter so once you've done that, 80 sarum is your present values and 6% is your interest rate, 5% is your M, 0 is PMT computed, you all. It's 107986, so you can see exactly. 
yeah if you want to pause a second uh, you can just say if you compound at a daily and then five year you'll have more uh 928 uh 928 dollar more if you only compound at the compared to compound at the annually so yeah always compound at you know daily or monthly so it's much better compound than compound at the annually okay that's it